everyone welcome to my channel today on my channel i will be teaching you how to prepare a for roll a for roll is also known as spinach stew here are the ingredients i will be using today let's start cooking as you can see guys i've sorted out my spinach now it's time to wash it to ensure it is clean next i'm going to chop the spinach and set it aside next i'm going to season my beef ingles onion ingles seasoning ingles salt stir cover and allow to cook for at least 15 minutes it has cooked for 15 minutes now it's time to hard my assorted meat remember guys this has been pre-cooked now it's time to stir them together and cover to cook for another 10 minutes it has cooked for another 10 minutes now it is ready it's time to start blending our peppers when you're blending ensure it is roughly blended we need those beautiful colors in a lovely yummy spinach stew now it's time to blanch our spinach by hardening hot water I'm going to do the same to my dry fish. I'm going to add a little bit of hot water. It helps to clean and soften the fish. My pot has heated up. Now I'm going to add my red oil. In goes my red oil. I'm going to allow it for just a minute. Now it's time to add my onion. In goes my onion. Allow to fry for a minute. Next, in goes my locust beans. Allow to fry for a few seconds. Next, in goes my blended peppers. I'm now going to allow my peppers to fry for 10 minutes. My peppers are fried for 10 minutes. Now it's time to hard my crayfish. I love to hard my crayfish when I'm frying my peppers because I don't want my crayfish to get burnt. Next, I'm going to hard my dry fish. In goes my dry fish. Stir. Allow to fry for one minute. Next, I'm going to hard my seasoning cube. In goes my salt to taste. Stir. Next, in goes my starfish. Next, in goes my prawns. Stir. In goes my stockfish. Stir. Now it's time to add my bomo. This is yummy. Trust me. Until you test it, do not judge. Next, I'm going to add a little bit of jumbo seasoning just to balance my seasoning. In goes my assorted meat and stir. Look at that color. It's looking really nice. This has cooked for at least 10 minutes. Now I'm going to add my spinach. It doesn't take time to cook. 
in goes my spinach and stir look at that look at how beautiful how yummy my eforiro is looking when you're cooking eforiro and you have assorted meat in it it is yummy trust me when you're cooking eforiro and you have various orishi rishi called assorted meat in your yummy eforiro it is mm, heaven trust me look at how lovely how beautiful my eforiro is looking now i'm gonna allow my eforiro to cook for at least 10 more minutes and my yummy delicious eforiro will be ready to serve look at how beautiful look at how inviting my eforiro is looking now it's time to serve look at that isn't this yummy isn't this mouth watering eforiro if you have this with pounded yam with your rice with boiled yam boiled plantain it is yummy trust me guys what are you waiting for have you already subscribed to my channel if you've not yet subscribed go to the right side of your phone and press subscribe also turn on your notification button so whenever i post my video you will be notified i'm sure you guys enjoyed today's video thanks for watching don't forget to share don't forget to like and see you in my next video bye bye ciao